what's up youtube so this is the unboxing of the airport express from apple that i just got today my old modem is really like getting worse and worse it drops connection it's a d-link dir 300 and it's been like in use since five years so i decided to get this first my first Apple modem which is the Express I will be telling you why I got it a little bit later in this video so stay tuned So this is the box, let's lift the modem up, you see how small it is, it's really small and it's really nice, it's kind of like the Apple TV but in white. So let's peel this one up. It's a very nice material. Let's peel this one off. So, on the front there is one indicator light. As you can see here, it's not focusing. Here it is, and this is the Apple logo. On the right side, there is nothing, as well. On the left side, there is nothing. On the back, there is the cable for power cable, and this is the in for the ethernet and this is the out and this is the usb port for your uh, printer and this is the headphone jack for the uh, speakers if you want to use it for airplay so let's see what else is inside the box This is a power cable, as you can see it's for Europe, because I live in Europe. And this is the setup guide, and as well as other information. Well, you don't get Apple stickers here, because it's an accessory. So, One good thing about it is that you can really set it up easily with your iPhone, iPad or iPod. Just download the airport utility from App Store. You can use this modem even with your Windows PC. You just go ahead and download the airport utility from Apple.com. So I'm connecting the power cable, the flash is green, then yellow. I'm gonna use my iPad for configuring it, you go to the Wi-Fi networks. You have to wait till the modem will start flashing yellow. That's when it's ready to connect. And then it will appear in the wireless networks.
as you see here and here it is So you can choose whether you want to create a new network or connect it to a previous modem that you have. I'm gonna choose a new network but my modem is not plugged in my Ethernet so I'll be doing that later. I hope you get the idea how to connect it if you are having troubles of connecting it. Anyway guys, if you like this video please like it and subscribe and feel free to ask any questions. Thank you for watching.